Hello all. Well, you know, I've, I've often said that there's probably going to be three main heads of death for the people of the world if we let it happen. I've always said it'll either be environmental, oil depletion, or war. Well, it looks like the heads are certainly uh, battling for position. First, we have the war head, which is uh, <laughs> blazing. We have the environmental head of global climate change, where unbelievable storms and that type of thing are going on in record amounts. I'm sure we're about to come out with uh, some record uh, temperatures for last month. And we had the, uh, the oil thing, the, uh, whether we deplete ourselves of oil before we can figure out how to live without it. Uh, that, that one's down a bit, but the rest of them, especially the warhead, is way up there, ready to go. And see, what my thoughts are is that we'll be so busy with the warhead that we'll never even pay attention to the environmental disaster that's going on at the same time. But the military-industrial complex isn't slowing down one bit. Let's take a look real quickly at the arms sales. Just recently, the, the big one is the U.S. has, has agreed to fast-track arms sales to the Middle East. Uh, a lot of arms have gotten blown up by Russia and, uh, you know, by mistakes and that sort of thing. And they need to uh, get those arms back into the uh, ISIS and the, the, the friendly rebels whatever their name is this week. And of course the U.S. is concerned about a Russian sale to Iran of arms and ammunition. And let's not uh, forget about the U.K. They boosted their last weapons sales from 2014 to 2015 to Egypt after the, the other deal they had. So now they've, they've sold Egypt 76.3 million dollars worth of arms in the first quarter of 2015. That, by the way, that's a 3,000 percent increase over last year. So, um, God, it's just gorgeous out today. It's, it's the most unusual weather I've ever seen in this time of the year. We're having really warm uh, nights, which are usually in October pretty cool, but the days can be warm. So while the rest of us are trying to deal with how to shut off the military industrial complex's head or at least calm it down some the military and our governments are doing everything they can to ratchet it up and let's not forget this is all about the banks and money isn't it all I can say war with Russia is a guaranteed nuclear war there's no doubt about it Yet the arms sales continue. So does that military head, and so does our environmental catastrophe here in California continue. Ah, good comments on the last video. I sure appreciate them. And uh, the ups and the downs and the uh, new subscribers. And until next time, 